everybody. I am still at my friend Greg's house. It's, I have no idea what time. Um, I'm leaving here at about 10.30 or so, 11 o'clock, for my next leg of my trip. Um, going to go meet up with another friend for a few hours uh, before I head over to my cousin's house. And, uh, Greg and I were sitting at the table last night and we were just talking and visiting and we definitely heard um, what we think was a couple of raccoons fighting. Yeah, and you know what? They have a boomer. Yeah, not a cat, but a dog. Boomer, boomer, boomer. Boomer's the big one right there. This is Boomer. I don't remember everybody else's names, but they're all so cute. They're all so cute. All right, good morning. It's uh, another very warm day here in uh, Corona, and uh, it's only going to get warmer. It's going to give you, it's definitely already in the 90s. And uh, I am going to be cleaning my truck. I'm going to, I already have an appointment to get uh, the last of the um, problem with the tires fixed and all I really need to do is wash the car and get pictures, make it presentable and try and sell it. Okay, so everybody's in the kitchen making breakfast and I just had to point out that Greg is wearing cat ears. Yeah. <laughs> He's fitting right in on the Neighborhood Community YouTube channel. We're wearing cat ears to match my friend Val's cat ears. <laughs> That's right. I have on my leopard ears. Mm-hmm. But those are the ears I gave to the baby, Isabella. Well, so. <laughs> she's sharing them with me. She's very nice for sharing. I'm going to introduce you to Shelby, one of Greg's daughters. And she's got a very interesting story about last night. She fell asleep in one place, woke up someplace completely different. She doesn't know how. I don't know. I was falling asleep in Crystal's room, then I rolled over when she left the room, and then this morning I woke up here on the couch. And I was on the air mattress, and I, I tried to tell her I carried her downstairs because I didn't want to be alone, but she doesn't believe me. I don't remember that. I want to bring the air mattress up here. You brought the air mattress up because you were going to sleep on the air mattress, and I was going to sleep on the couch. Um, <laughs> I don't remember that either. Uh, nope. 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 Nothing. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Lester. <Hello. laughs> she f she doesn't know how she got up here last night, or down here, up here, down here, down here. <laughs> strange, very very strange. <clears throat> she wasn't asleep when she came blonde. in. Here. <laughs> well, she is red right now. Is she normally blonde? I'm normally, I'm normally blonde. blonde. Okay. Well, that explains it. That explains it all. <laughs> <laughs> and Greg is still cooking with ears. He's ready for French toast. He's making French toast now. And, and that woman you see in the kitchen there with him? Say hi, Gina. Hi. <laughs> That's his wife. <laughs> and everybody loves my ears. We got... Who, who's got the other ones on? Leah. Leah's got my cheetah ears on. Say hi, Leah. Where's the baby? Greg's wearing them. Greg's wearing them. <laughs> Did you want them? Oh, those are more pretty for Greg. Greg. <laughs> oh, you got oh, no. Isabella's got her cat <laughs> yeah, ears on. Okay, I'm gonna go closer so I can get a better <laughs> shot of him with the purple ears on. Hi, Greg. You're a purple <laughs> kitty. <laughs> hey, Greg. You look so purple. Kitties purring. are more sexy. Purple. All right, French toast is rolling. French toast is wrong. Look at this, guys. We got French toast. We got sausage and bacon, and we got eggs cooking over here. Some toast. And some toast going over here. You don't have ears. You want to wear my ears for now? No? You want a bow? I think she likes cheetah. Kelly, do you want my ears? Ah, she wants the cheetah ears. 
Then we're gonna put you on YouTube with the cheetah ears. Can you growl like a yeah. cheetah? No? Are you shy? Do we think Lester needs some ears? Yep. Sure. I won't put cinnamon on them yet. And Lester is a leopard. <laughs> ah, there you go. That's what we needed. Oh, thank you, girl. There's Mommy and Isabella. I am on the road again. I fueled up, got something to drink, took some Tylenol because I got a pretty bad headache. Got a little bit of sleep last night. I'd say I probably got about three, maybe four hours of solid sleep, which is actually pretty good for me. Look at that view right now, guys. Go under this bridge. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely gorgeous. So I'm on the second part of my trip right now, and I am heading up to Upper State, New York, to meet up with some more friends of mine. I will check in with you guys as we go. It's about a three hour drive or so, so that'll be pretty exciting. A lot less of a drive than I did yesterday, so that's always nice. All right, so I had to wait until about six in the uh, evening to start washing my truck because it was still in the 90s most of the day. So it's in the 80s, and uh, my truck is pretty filthy. I have already um, taken a, a compressor and blown all the, the leaves and stuff out of my bed. And let's see if I can clean some of this bed up. I've got some paint actually back there. <sighs> what a drag. It happens when you actually use your truck for something. So, got my floor mats out. I'm going to clean those as best as I can. And uh, I figured I'd clean it myself because um, I can't afford anything else. And I can actually get stuff that's stuck on off that they wouldn't do otherwise. And I have to treat the plastic. And I have this stuff. And um, I hope there's enough of it because it didn't come with a lot. We'll see how that works out. Okay guys, I am in a little town here. Not exactly sure where but this is where the GPS has taken me. It's got some really cute little houses, got some pretty big fields. Beautiful view. However, I've been driving for about an hour on roads like this where there's nothing but fields and farms and I have to pee. <laughs> I'm about to actually stop and knock on someone's door. <laughs> That's how bad I have to pee and I can't find any place to pee. Wonderful, wonderful morning um, leaving Greg's house and most of the drive was fantastic until I got a speeding ticket. Kind of bummed. And then I got lost. <laughs> so I'm sitting here waiting for my friends to find me. I'm sitting on the side of the road right now. They said they know exactly where I am to stay put and they will come to me. I finally made it to my destination. My friends came and found me lost, stranded on the side of the road because I got lost. Yes, I did. I got lost. And you'll never guess who my friends were. That's right. I've been keeping this one a secret from you guys. So, hi! Hi, Sylvia! Hi, neighborhood community. I'm so thrilled to meet Val. This is so exciting to me. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So exciting to me. <laughs> You're like a movie star to me. <laughs> Just a normal person. No. You're not. You're a We're vlogging YouTube each other. star. <laughs> and it's so exciting. I'm so glad you asked if I wanted to meet you. I'm, I'm awesome. glad you were able to and I'm so glad 
I, when I first got out of the car and I said hi to Bethany, it was so sweet. I was not expecting her to hug me. And not only did she hug me, guys, she tickled me. She gave you the famous tickles. Yeah, she tickled me. And that was just so amazing. I'm so happy. Her and Malcolm just ran to go pick up some tacos. Um, but when they get back, you guys will get to meet Malcolm and Bethany as well. So I'm so excited. <laughs> Bethany gets out of the car. But they can always film her in the car. Yeah. Look who's coming, everybody. It's Bethany. <laughs> One of my favorite people in the whole Hello, wide world. <laughs> Are you happy now? Get love you. Oh, she loves I you. love you too. <laughs> Sit down. I love you too. She is little. She is little. She is little. She's tiny, huh? She just didn't grow bigger. <laughs> The what we're doing. Hey, sit down. You need to water me? Is that what you said? <laughs> she wants you to. <laughs> sit down. <laughs> I'm gonna tickle you. That's okay. Look at everybody. Say, say hello. Look here. Can you see yourself? Can you see yourself in there? We're <laughs> going on a little one. A little tiny bear with stars and a bear with hearts. One with clovers. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Wow, that's a lot of bears, Beth. We have wow. a bear collection now. Do you like bears? Oh nice. yeah, that's a yes. The full body turn. Can you say thanks? Thanks, Val. Say thanks, Val. You can say in person this time. You're welcome. And I have some very beautiful pictures that I colored for you and your mom, but I left them at home. <laughs> so you're going to get them in the mail. You like getting things in the mail? Mm. Yeah. Definitely. You're going to be getting stuff in the mail when I get back home. And the mailman makes sure she gets them. <laughs> yes, the mailman. The mailman. the mailman. And everybody, this is Malcolm. Hello. Hello. <laughs> So guys, that was my second visit of the day. Sylvia and Malcolm and yes, Bethany. I hope you guys all enjoyed that. I certainly did. It was great to see Bethany. I really enjoyed spending time with her and getting tickles and kisses and hugs. So now I am actually heading to my cousin's house in Connecticut and tomorrow I am hoping to have another meetup with another friend. So we will keep you updated. Bye for now. All right, so I'm done working for the day. I have cleaned the truck. It's a lot of truck to clean. And um Took me maybe an hour and a half. I still have to deal with uh, plastic and other detailing that I need to deal with. Clean the windows because I only kind of clean the windows. Uh, I need to vacuum and uh, shampoo carpet. And on Tuesday I get to fix the tire gauge um, and then it should be good to go. I think I'm in Boston. I can only show him for four seconds. <laughs> I know that wasn't even four seconds because he started counting before I pointed the camera at him. So anyway, I made it here safe and sound. I am spending the night and I am meeting up with some neighborhood community subscribers tomorrow. I'm not going to tell you who they are. You'll have to wait and see. So anyway, 
you'll get to see who I met up with today when you see tonight's vlog. So I'm going to say goodnight to you all and hang out with my cousin for the rest of the night and I'm going to try and go to bed at a decent hour. I'm going to try and go to sleep at a decent hour. <laughs> Let's say that. Anyway, please give us a like, a share, comment, all that happy crappy stuff. And we will see you guys all tomorrow. Bye!